what is up? It is Chris here. Here to talk about meetups and group rides and all that kind of shit that I'm doing this summer. It's going to be insane this next couple months. I've got a whole list of stuff I'm doing. I actually had to make a list on my phone so I can remember it all for this video. I am going to be busy doing lots of rides here and there from you know just riding out somewhere to meet up with friends to you know big meetups and big rides and stuff first thing that's going on is this is Memorial Day weekend for uh, everybody in the US knows what's going on with that uh, happy Memorial Day to all to all your veterans thank you thank you for your service But sometime Monday, maybe, I don't know, might be taking a ride with my friend Motor Nerd. He is an up and coming vlogger. He has uh, just got his drift, so he hasn't really started yet. But uh, he's going to be, we're, eh, might be taking a ride somewhere, maybe High Point, I don't know. He's mentioned that he wants to uh, get out and ride. So. We'll see about that. Thursday, this coming Thursday, 29th, I might be meeting somebody up in Chatterbox in Frankfurt, New Jersey. Apparently they have a bike night there Thursdays. So, he wanted to had some questions about the V-Strom, so I told him that's like, hey, you know, I'll beat up and go over it Saturday June 7th cross country power sports Metuchen New Jersey having their open house now last couple years they've had a stunt show and stuff I haven't seen anything on the flyers about that I don't know if uh, it's always been uh, Chris Teach McNeil cool guy um, got a chance to, you know, meet him, shake his hand at, uh, the, the uh, the, the, the International Motorcycle Show in New York. But he may, I, I don't know if he's going to be there this year, but he's been there the last couple of years. They've done open houses. Uh, I plan on attending that if the weather's nice. Again, that's in Metuchen. You can look it up online. Sunday, June 15th. This is a big one for me. This is the Kelsey Charity Run. I do it every year. Rain or shine. It is one of the biggest charity runs in the my area. For a good cause. All the money goes directly towards families who have children affected with serious illnesses. Again, I've done videos about it in the past. I've done, you know, I've met a couple guys there. So I will be hitting that one up. Uh, I will have more information on my uh, Facebook page as they figure out where I'm meeting people and stuff like that. Saturday, July 19th. Operation New York Cheesecake. This is the big one. Hosted by El Fad, Defobra, Mark S4303, and the rest of the New York crew. This is going to be big this year. Last year it was like 15 people. Today we have 50 saying they're going, so we're expecting over at least over 40. Because, you know, some people are going to have to change plans and stuff. So it's a fun ride. We're not a bunch of lunatics. We're just a bunch of guys. Been going up with these guys to... Uh, Scout out routes up in Westchester. Some of the roads are pretty damn cool. I'll put a link to the Facebook group in the description. Hotel and information and all that stuff is in there. The weekend after, July 24th, which is going to be Thursday, I'm going to be heading up to Canada, most likely. I haven't res I haven't done any concrete plans, I haven't reserved any hotels. I'll be riding up there Thursday. Just going from where I am all the way up. 
going up to probably Gulf Canada, which is outside of Toronto a bit. I will then, Friday, be riding back down to the Niagara Falls area and play the tourists. You know, I've never seen Niagara Falls, so this is a chance to, for me to do that, so I'm not going to miss it. You know, spend the day wandering around, doing the whole boat ride, and standing over the falls, and oohing and on and taking pictures and all that stuff. Then, the next day, Saturday, I hope, I hope, I hope, if uh, work schedules and stuff co coincide, taking a ride out with 13 Here Comes the Sun and Wild Bill, meet up with them, hang out. If anybody else is in the area, I, th I think uh, DeFober mentioned that six foot foe Honda lives up in that area. Maybe I could uh, wrangle him to come out, come come out for a bit. You know, just again, hang out, ride, an excuse to meet up, to go to dinner and stuff like that. Then Sunday, I'm coming back down to where I am. After that, it's a bit quiet until September 29th. That's a Saturday. This is a big trip I took last year, Deals Gap. We will be meeting in Sweetwater, Tennessee this time, not Franklin, um, last time we met in Franklin, North Carolina. Uh, Sweetwater is actually better for me because instead of cutting down through North Carolina, it just goes straight down, what is that, 83 or something, right into Sweetwater, so it should shave an hour, an hour and a half off the ride. I'm going to be riding down, I'm going to be riding straight down one day. Again, there's a, there's a Facebook group about this. I'll put a link in the description. This is being run by Trinith. If you've never been to the Gap, it is one of the, totally one of those bucket list things to do. Yes, today I am on a mission. Now, on the Strong Troopers forum, they have a couple little challenge games that keep going on. One of them is the motorcycle picture thread, and and the other one is the V-Strom picture game. Uh, I'll talk about the first one, which is the motorcycle picture thread. Somebody comes up with a topic, posts a picture to, you know, as an example. I mean, uh, I think the current, yeah, the current one is biggest oops, you know, biggest fail. But there's been, you know you know, best shot from above the bike, and you know, just different pictures and, you know, any kind of pictures of any of your motorcycles that you currently own that you have in stock or go get. You know, they post them throughout the week and then, you know, the beginning of the next week they vote on them. Whoever wins gets to pick the next topic. So, the other one, which is the one I am currently trying to do, is the V-Strom picture game. Now this one is not voting, this is first come first serve. That current topic is your picture with a motorcycle in front of a town clock, freestanding. Now this one again is different, this is first come first serve. And it has to be a brand new picture, you can't have one in your files and go out and post it. No, when the, when the challenge is put out, you have to go out and get a picture and post it. Whoever gets there first picks the next topic. So I happen to know where there is a freestanding clock. I am heading there now. Gonna snap a quick picture and see if I can upload this before anybody else. You will see on my Facebook page, or you will have seen because by the time I edit this video, picture of my bike in front of a clock and you'll probably be going, what the fuck is that for? There is the clock. Now I just gotta get to it.
Alright. Thank you. Why are you stopping? You're making me nervous. I don't know.